Hello everyone. Recently I came up with an idea for a new tool, which is called a slope correction tool. This tool mainly has two uses. First one is with this tool you can change the slope of any building. Say for example, initially you you have designed a building for a slope of one is to ten, but later because of client revisions or some optimization requirement. You are changing the slope to 0.5 to 10 or 1.5 to 10. So, what you have to do, you have to change the change the raster slope manually in the model, right? Like, so, it might be a tedious process. With the slope correction tool, this can be achieved within a fraction of second. Then, the second usage is if you see this model. The rafter is modeled in such a way that the center line of the rafter is in a slope, but the actual condition would be somewhat different, right? In the actual scenario, the rafter top flange will be in a straight line, forming the slope. So achieving this in a stat model is quite a tedious process, and with the slope correction tool, we can achieve that as well. So let me demonstrate. In order to correct the slope, you have to select the rafter sections first. So I'm selecting it, and I'm moving to the slope correction tool. Here, it has a slope input. So whether I am going to provide the input as a gradient or an angle, choose any one. Say gradient. So. I want to maintain one is to ten slope, so it is automatically calculating the slope angle, and just run slope correction. So as we could see, the process is completed, and uh, since the model is initially in one is to ten, there is you you can't see much change, but you can see that that the top flange is aligned exactly in a straight line. Right, so let us change the slope. Now, say I'm going to use three is to ten, around sixteen degree. Tada! So we got it right, and hope this tool would be very helpful. And thank you.